Do you have a classical composer or piece that brings you joy? Tchaikovsky Piano Concerto Number no. 1, Van Cliburn playing. Oh. Far too many to name, but most recently, Amy Beach, Peace I Leave With You. Absolutely. It is Brandenburg Concerto Number no. 3. And I thought I was in heaven when I first listened to that. It actually inspired me to write a piece of poetry about it. It was one of the best things I've ever played on the viola. It brings me such joy. What was the first concert I saw live? Well, the first concert that I ever saw live was the Boys Choir of Harlem when I was eight years old. I was fortunate enough to grow up in Boston, and my mom took me all the time to hear the Boston Symphony Orchestra. That would be the amazing Phyllis Hyman at the Dell Theater in Philadelphia, where I'm originally from. And I remember sitting there as a young child in the, like the first few rows and watching the amazing Boston Symphony Orchestra playing. And after I saw them, I desperately wanted to join, but I was too afraid to ask my parents to send me. It blew my mind. It changed my life. She inspired me to no end because she still inspires me. What musician slash artist inspires you? When I need peace, uh, I listen to the piano concerti of Rachmaninoff. I love going to concerts, all different kinds of concerts. I have many, many, many artists that inspire me. But when I need inspiration, I look to my students. Maria Callas, Ben Vereen, um, so many, I don't even know where to start or stop. Art inspires me, not necessarily a sp specific person, but true artistry is what inspires me. What advice would I give young LGBTQ people looking to pursue music? Your voice matters. Fear does not. Be authentic. Be your true self. I would say absolutely go for it. Don't let the opportunity to be heard pass you by. Find your path. Never be afraid to sing. Uh, speak, dance, or march what you have on your heart. Be the best version of you. Be the best artist you are. Don't worry about being someone else. You bring you to the table. Uh, there will only ever be one you. So don't let anybody say to you, you have to go down a certain path because you identify in a certain way. But mostly, Practice, practice, practice. Thank you so much, Laco, for letting us send you some pride, love. Thank you, thank you.